In this episode, I want to show how I change colors of my image using adjustment layers. To change the color of the wings from gray to brown so that it matches the rest of the body, I added the selective color adjustment. By default, the adjustment layer is added above the selected layer and affects all of the layers below. I didn't want that, so I used the right click on my adjustment and masked it below to confine it just to the wings layer. To get a nice brown color, I just needed to adjust the settings for whites, neutrals and blacks and add more magenta and yellow and reduce the amount of cyan. Next I wanted to make the rock darker against the moon shining in the background, so I selected the rock layer and added the shadows highlights adjustment. I masked it below and then moved the slider for shadows all the way to the left. Then I applied the color balance adjustment to add a bluish tint to the areas of the rock that reflect the moonlight. When I finished color correcting individual layers, I started making adjustments to the whole project. I used the split toning to add a blue tint to highlights and shadows across the whole image. I also played with other adjustments like selective color, color balance, white balance and vibrance to create harmony between warm and cool colors in my composition. As the final step, I added some contrast with the levels adjustment. When comparing before and after, you can see how my color palette changed from warm earthy tones to cool blue tones that reflect my idea of mysterious night scene. In my next video, I'll show you how to add the final details like stars and fog and how to bring more depth to the whole image.